sea sponges are some of the simplest animals on the planet. In fact, some experts say they're more like a big group of cells than like other animals. Sponges have no muscles, nerves, or internal organs. But they do have lots of chemicals that seem to help fight diseases in people. Drugs that fight viruses, cancer, and more have come from chemicals naturally produced by some of the world's estimated 9,000 species of sponges. We can learn about the associative property of addition by visiting a lab where scientists test these chemicals for disease-fighting properties. Say one scientist has 6.5 milliliters of one solution, 5.4 of another, and 3.2 of a third. Will the way he groups the solutions for testing affect the total amount he has? Let's see. He could first combine solutions A and B, mix them together to get 11.9 milliliters, then add the 3.2 milliliters of solution C. The total amount, 15.1 milliliters. Now, say he decides to combine solutions B and C separately and add that combination to A. The combination of B and C is 8.6 milliliters. Adding that to the 6.5 milliliters of solution A gets 15.1 milliliters. Same result. The associative property means it doesn't matter which two numbers in your equation you associate with each other first. In fact, think of the word associate when you want to remember what the associative property is. An operation has the associative property if the numbers can be grouped in any way without affecting the result.